fine so i hope you're all doing well please excuse the absolute state of my car honestly at this point my car is just essentially an extra storage unit um but anyway i'm currently just sat outside my mum's house and waiting for her to get on in because today it is officially the first christmas video that i'm going to be putting out of the year i am so excited i feel like this day is well and truly needed because i don't know about you guys but me at the moment i am not in the christmas spirit like normally as soon as it hits october and b and m and the range and all of them kind of stores are putting the christmas stuff in the stores i'm so excited like i'm on just another level of excitement for christmas but this year I don't know, it just feels like really slow for me, the build up. Um, I think because we've been having so much warm weather and like it's still been sunny, not really been getting the coats and stuff out, I've just not really been feeling Christmassy. Like, I don't know, does anyone else relate or feel me? Um, but yeah, today we're gonna have a little trip and go around all the shops. We're basically doing a lot today. One second, my mum is getting in. Might help if I open the door. Here she is. Hello. Um, but yeah, basically, we're going to head around all the shops today. We're going to go like the range, which I always feel is like the best for really inexpensive. I say inexpensive, but it's probably cheaper than most places, isn't it, Mum? Get your hair cut. Yeah. Wow, that's well sure. How much <laughs> you had off it? A lot. Jeez. When do you make these decisions about consulting me? It'll grow. <laughs> it will grow. No, it's nice. I do like you with longer hair, though. Yeah. Yeah, but I wanted. Needed a good cut. Yeah, it does look healthier. Sorry, we're just getting over the shock no. that my mum just gone and had about five inches of her hair about telling me. Um, but yeah, so we're going to go to the Rage, B&M maybe, Dunelm. I feel like Dunelm, like last year, we kind of missed that and then we went and Jeremy yeah. you know found the little gingerbread man and things. Yeah. They have cute bits in. Um, home Sense, but I don't know if to do Home Sense as like a whole separate video because it's like two floors and it's just that much in. I feel like that could be whole video in itself um and next home next home always has good bits in i would say matterland but there's not really one local to where we're going so check online for that because i don't have a good matterland around here there's no good matterlands like the Bermont Lees one is awful the leicester one is awful i think there's one decent one that i have been to in nottingham before but like nottingham's so big i think it was like the other side of nottingham um but yeah, anyway, I'm losing my voice. I'm going to go. Really hope this video gets you in the Christmas spirit and maybe inspires you with what colour scheme to go for your Christmas tree. I have already finalised my Christmas tree colour scheme now, haven't I? Yep. Obviously, I'm not going out buying all new because that would just be way expensive and I have so much Christmas stuff as is. But I'm adding a couple more colours into what I've already got. Well, not what I've already got. I don't know. We do know, but yeah. yeah. Well, you might actually find out in this video because when this video goes out it will literally be a couple of days before my tree goes up so oh, i'll keep it surprising no because then i feel like if you keep it a surprise and someone else does it then it's like you're copying them and i, I hate that so i'd rather tell people before because then it's not like oh you've copied so and so yeah. do you know what i mean so i will be telling you in this video <laughs> anyway guys i'm gonna shut up we're gonna head on to the shops now so i really hope you enjoy spending the day with me and mom and seeing all the christmas stuff in the stores let's go Walking around, feeling free, thinking about what's happened to me from July up till now. Don't know where, don't know how. Lately, I've come to realize that I can't see it in your eyes. So it's true. I'm so glad you feel it too. Nothing to Okay guys, so I've just shown you all of this side. I've just um, put some music alongside it. We'll show you our favourite picks in a minute. Um, but just a heads up, all the gorgeous like Christmas duvet sets are running out. Like you can see so many gaps already. They're definitely selling out fast. So if you want a Christmas duvet set, then run. Um, they're quite affordable in here. Because obviously I feel like you don't really want to spend too much on a Christmas duvet, do you? No, but people but, are having these because it's in a put the heating on it. It's going to be cold. And these yeah, are, these, these are, are like, warm they're brushed. They're that real nice fabric. Well, these ones are even better, Mum. Yeah. These red ones. That's in it, like, you've got like a little... Um, Two pillowcases. A bag, not Yeah, it's really nice. And they're then... Nice. Yeah, they've got those cupcake things. 
um, all the duvet sets, and then they've also got some really nice pillows in. So you've got, I've been very naughty. I've been very nice. Oh, well, look, the festive runner. Oh my okay. God, look at that, festive runner. Oh, nice. Didn't even see that. Me and Mum just keep seeing new things all the time. So I really love all of these little serving things. I think for 3.50 they're good, isn't there? Yeah. Um, the Christmas plates. These are nice as well, these tea towels are really good quality. Mm. They feel lovely. And I really love these um, tree placeholders. They're really pretty. So much nice um, like tableware stuff, isn't there, in here? There's lots of nice, like, saying, different leaves. Yeah. Ones. And we really like these as well. Little Christmas serving board with little bowls. Ooh, that's cute. Mum's just found this. This Christmas wood light up block. Oh, this one. Yeah, that's nice as well. Seven pound. I really love this penguin, guys. Look how nice this penguin is for 15 pounds. Honestly, Mum, I, if I could have this in my house somewhere, I would. Just look at him. Honestly. How cute is he? He's £15 though. <laughs> Don't need you mate, sorry. Blue is really in this year guys. And B&M have honestly got some gorgeous baubles, £2.50 for those. And then they have this set for a fiver that I think is really nice. Got some beautiful bits. Also, they've got a gorgeous wreath. It's quite expensive though, £30. Is that light up? No. I don't know. How much are these garlands, Mum? £30 for the garland as well. Mm. Expensive, they are lovely though, but... They've got the blue skirt there, isn't it? Mmm. snowflakes as they're falling down And follow Rudolph all across the town Play it with me under the mistletoe Oh, they've got loads of cute stuff for kids as well if you make them like Christmas Eve boxes. Little things to put out for Santa. Oh, Mum, look at these. Look, you put your little biscuit mm -hmm. in the front bit. They're cute. Look, they've got these for £1 that you could put in your Christmas Eve box. We never had Christmas Eve boxes when we were younger. No, we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, they've got straw. Oh, my God, how cute are them straws, Mum? Very nice. Christmas straws. Oh, and look at this. That's cute, love that. Okay, so we're just looking at all the red stuff now. I really like the velvet ones, not so much the star ones, but yeah, the velvet colour I really like. Got some, again, more wreaths. They, oh, they've also got some uh, overdoor reef hooks. This is what I use to hang my reef up if you're wondering, two pound in here. Yeah, oh, I like you can do that on a plastic one. But even if it's uh Well, yeah, it works on my door. Don't know about your door. But you just put it on the top of the door and it just shut, the door shuts normally. I don't know about your door, because yours is plastic, mine's not a plastic door, mine's a... Ah, uh, uh, mine's a, um... Singing hi to every friendly face And later we warm up by the fireplace Carolers are singing outside our door Lovely songs we all heard before As they walk from house to... What have you found, Mum? That's oh, nice, isn't it? 18 pounds. Yeah, it's not, yeah, it's a lot cheaper than the other ones around the corner that are 35 pound. I bet that's a 35 pound one as well. These are nice, guys. I'm really loving. I want someone to do the kind of like dark green and gold theme and um, send me a picture of the tree. What have you found now, Mum? Little <laughs> Robin, so cute. Yeah, I really like that dark green colour this year that seems to be in. Yeah, I like that. Mmm. What is it? Paper? Yeah. It's nice, isn't it? I feel like that's for like more of a minimal tree. I like that look, but I don't really do minimal tree. <laughs> yeah, that's nice as well. Okay, let's have a little look at the crackers. There's not many crackers. I like the little mini ones. It's a shame they don't have these in like a different colour. For my, mm. my table. I want to do a little table decor. And then um, they've got loads of nice bags and gift wrap. This gift wrap I really like, six pound. I think that's really nice. Um, yeah, got all different colours. And I'll tell you what I do like. So like for the kids that I buy for, I always like getting these like fun Santa ones. This is nice, Laura. 
Oh yeah, personalised gift box, £3, then you can put someone's name on it. That's really nice if you want to make someone a gift box. They also have money wallets here, which is handy if you're giving money. And I really like this gift box with bear and tag, three fifty. Absolutely love that. It's the same as the wrapping paper. You might get that. You turn that over and it's like a little pom-pom on the... Oh, I've just shown them. I didn't realise they did that. Yeah, they are cute. We've also got tons of ribbon as well. I always like to just decorate in plain like brown paper and then just get like loads of nice ribbon. Say hi. hi. <laughs> What's your name? Olivia. Just met Olivia down the Christmas aisle, just looking mm -hmm. at all the Christmas stuff. Thank you. See ya. <laughs> Oh, these ribbons are nice. Four pound, and there's a five pack. Mom, what are you doing now? That's not even in the Christmas aisle. <laughs> also, these wine, um, you get three bottle bags, and they are two pound. Love those. Do you get three? That's really good value. Oh, love those. Uh, you get three bottle bags for two pound, Mom. And they're nice, aren't mm. they? I like them. Um, I think that's about it for wrapping paper. We've also got like gold bags. Oh, they're quite good value as well, Mum. You get free gift bags. Okay, so that's being I'm done. I just thought I'd voice over this bit. So we then took a trip to Home Sense TK Maxx. They had some gorgeous throws. I really like this green one with the white Christmas trees on. They had so many snow glows, and I always think snow glows are a really nice way to just add some decoration in. Of course, the candle department is just always the one in Home Sense and TK Maxx, and they had some absolutely beautiful ones in. I feel like the range of candles is probably bigger and better than ever this year. I honestly couldn't decide which one I wanted. Um, but yeah, the aesthetic of them and the smell, there was just such a big variety. So definitely check them out if you're on the hunt for some new Christmas candles. They also had a huge range of wreaths and garlands in. And personally, I feel like these are better than B&M because they're around about the same price, right? They look a bit bigger and yeah, there's just more on a lot of them and they also light up. So yeah, definitely check out Home Sense for your wreaths and garlands again. Oh my goodness, the variety of garlands was huge. There's definitely going to be something for your colour scheme. So yeah, I thought that was really good as well in Home Sense. And then just the aisles are all quite miscellaneous, I think so it's quite specific to what kind of colour scheme you're going for so yeah it's always good just to have a little nose and see like what bits they have because you always find the odd bit in home sense me and mum thought we'd just have a little look at the gift wrap ribbons christmas cards because again i always feel like home sense does this good they have different bits in that you can't get everywhere else and again it's always quite reasonable i actually found some paper chase wrapping paper from here which is brown you guys know i use brown paper like most years and then decorate and the whole pack should have originally been 22 pound and i got all these rolls 4.99 you'll see now i was so impressed with that so yeah if you see them definitely grab them We've also got loads of nice towels. These are all about $10.99, but you get two. These are really cute. Yeah, there's so many different designs. And then we've also got loads of tea towels out. I'm forgetting what I've shown you and what I've not, guys, but all the plateware stuff and serving stuff is so cute as well in here we've got this three bowl serving tree thing oh is that what's that is that a halloween one mom yeah look at that that's nice what? i think my camera was on a weird setting 12.99 then they've got loads of nice like casserole dishes oh look at all this stuff you could go mad couldn't you mm. and just have everything christmasy little rampkins they are literally going all out this year how cute is this? Me and mum just found this. It was like, what is this? Holiday charm tree. And basically it comes with like all these different like bauble charms and you hang them on the tree and it like basically doubles up as a decorative thing. But then you also, when you're making a, like your friend's drink, you can put the charms on your wine glasses. Yeah. That's so cute. There's so much um, nice like tableware and like we love this. It's 15 pound, which I don't need it. They've also got coffee ones. What's that? Oh, they're cute. Santa's. They've also got loads of like nice mugs. They've got a jar for four ninety nine. That's 
cute. Not a puffy one. That's nice. Me and Mum are just looking upstairs because like there's always just a load of Christmas stuff like just merged in with everything. Found these nice aprons. I love doing Christmas baking as you guys know. They've got a Robin one and they're only six ninety nine. and we just looked in. Where did we look and see them Mum and they're really expensive? Is it the garden centre? They're like £15. They've got a Robin one and the one that I just got. The sausage dog one, how cute. And they've also got like a more plain one if you just want to be, do you know what I mean? A little bit more simpler. And then if I turn around, they've got all of the Christmas doormats in, which are very hard to see. I'm already like wrecking the joint around here. Is there any nice ones, mum? Red one, Merry Christmas. Oh my god, guys, look, Christmas cat oil thing. That is so cute, but I don't need that. That is not, it's not a need, is it? And they've also got so many nice Christmassy jars. How much were they in B&M, though? Because they had them in mm. B&M. And mum liked this as well. Mum's obsessed with sausage dogs now. <laughs> oh my god, guys, the baking section. I am living for this. Look at all these cute little things, mum. How much are these? Four ninety nine. That's not even bad. Oh no, they've got more royal things here, Mum. Little jars. That is a gorgeous mixing bowl. You get the batter jug and utensil set. How much are we guessing? Eight pounds. Fourteen ninety nine. It's a lot, isn't it? And then we also have. Oh, look at all these to put on top of your cupcakes. How cute. $3.99 nice. and then just like loads of cutter sets and stuff. Next we took a trip to Dunham. I'm sorry that like half this video is voiceover and half is just like me and mum talking. I just thought I'd do some voiceover bits because some places obviously didn't have as much good stuff in and then there's people next to me and it's awkward. But yeah, Dunham always have a real nice range of stuff in. They have loads of nice mixing bowls and again like tableware, um, plateware, that kind of stuff. They always have a really good range and it's quite inexpensive too. They also had a little table set out which looked cute. I also really like these tea towels and oven mitts. Um, they were £6 each. And then bauble wise, it wasn't seen a lot, I'm not gonna lie. So I didn't really film a lot in the bauble section of Dunham. Then we headed over to Next. Um, they hadn't got loads and loads out, but I did obviously vlog what I could. They had so much gingerbread stuff, it was ridiculous. And I just love gingerbread stuff at Christmas. So cute, this chopping board. Obviously, Next is slightly pricier, so I didn't get anything. They had so many nice baubles too, really good bauble set. Section. They had this real nice like Christmas pudding casserole dish and then loads of stuff for kids too. Okay, and then the last place we nipped to was the range for a quick browse around. So this is the Leicester store. They had so many garlands. Um, they're slightly cheaper than places like Home Sense. So definitely have a little look in here. Um, and then I noticed they had a lot of like monochrome and black and white decor in this year, which I didn't see last year. So I really liked all of this. They had a few nice baubles there. I also spotted a few like different raspberry and kind of burgundy style baubles that they had this year which I thought were really nice and they're like £2.29 so I thought they were quite reasonable. They had quite a lot of like brown baubles too but as you can see the shelves did look a little sparse like there wasn't loads in. I don't know if they're still like getting it in and doing this area but yeah me and mum felt a bit flat in here like normally this is our favourite place to come at Christmas but um yeah everything felt just like a bit samey from previous years and there wasn't a lot of like new stuff in. These baubles were really nice as well these kind of like plain ones and white ones they also had a real nice selection of like gray and a few green but yeah there wasn't heaps I then nipped in Matalan the other day just to pick up an order I made online and oh my goodness the Christmas stuff was out and it is so good in there like 
honestly, Matalan is so underrated, and I always forget to go there, to be honest with you. They have these gorgeous cushions in for £14, which I think would look amazing on your sofa or in your bedroom. They have so many, like, nice just home bits. These diffusers for £6.50. This little sign was only three fifty as well, which I thought was really cute. They have so many nice baubles. I really like these paper baubles that seem to be everywhere this year. There's so much, like, nice white stuff as well. I'm not doing white, um, but, yeah, if you are, then really recommend having a little look. They also had loads of really nice kitchenware as well. Absolutely loving all of this. And it's quite inexpensive as well. Like, it's not overly expensive for some of the bits. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go because I'm going to run out of footage soon. But thank you so much for watching my Christmas come shot of me. Definitely check out Matt online because it is loads better. Um, thank you for watching. I shall see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.